Oh, we do, do we do this thing? Or what's the, uh... In 1958, the plaza offered to its new residents the finest shopping experience Point Claire has ever seen. Now, 60 years later, the current merchants have challenged me to come back to the mall to prove that the Point Claire Plaza hasn't lost its mojo. Join me as we ask the experts. <laughs> Let's try this again. Hi. Welcome to Ryan's. This week we went to Ryan's. Ryan's is the place with the big Union Jack in the front and on the inside wall and on the other inside wall. So I was there to see the manager, Claire. I'm the manager. Claire is the manager. I'm the manager. <laughs> What am I getting myself into here? It's a candy store, but we also have a huge range of British imports. Now, I don't consider myself a foodie, but I can certainly pretend to be. So let's just nosedive right into the products. Let's start the tour. This is the crisp section. What do you call <laughs> chips? Taste that. Oh my God. See? It's not bad. It's pretty good. <laughs> this That's is a, a skip. A skip. That's prawn cocktail. Damn. This texture is so much better than a chip. <laughs> so apparently we don't know how to do chips here in Canada. You have Lay's. I have. You have Lay's here, we have Walker's. Wait, let me remember what a Lay tastes like. Greasy. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently our Lay's stink. We have to switch to Walkers now. Oh. Mm. If Lay's wasn't a bad name to begin with, I gotta switch to Walkers. England is coming. <laughs> so the next were the cookies. Oh, that one, what would you like to try? Give me one. Just give me, hit me with your best shot. Fire away. <laughs> hit me with your best shot. Digestive. Mmm, oh good. The taste was amazing, but what was even more amazing were the names of these products. Jammy Dodges, Lemon Puffs, Ginger Crunch. Lemon Lappies and Ginger Jappies and, and Pajami Pammies and... Toffee Pops, Fig Rolls, Penguins. Who's naming these products? Dr. Seuss? <laughs> Hobnockers? Hobnobs. So if you can make it past all this stuff and get right to the back, you'll notice that they have a grocery section. Huge variety of British grocery goods. Some grocery grappies. <laughs> we have jams, juices, fizzy drinks, scones, frozen products, pork pies. We also have a large selection that you can buy online at brickshop.ca, which also you can get mushy peas. Mushy peas. <laughs> I know you love mushy peas. <laughs> I'm gonna try some mushy peas. It's supposed to be mushy. Oh, it's chunky. Oh, it's not bad. I'm serious, it's good. Go get a spoon. So after sampling a bunch of grocery goods, it was time for dessert. Hey, do you want to taste any chocolate? On a walnut whip? A walnut whip. <laughs> Ooh, baked nice. on marshmallow. Yeah. Now do you want a man's chocolate bar? Yes, I do. The Yorkie. It's a man's bar. Have you had it? Of course I have. It's just solid chocolate. Mmm, my God. Look at those teeth marks. So we got a walnut whip and we got a Yorkie. I'll go for a curly whirly. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Is that caramel? Yeah. Oh. Mm. I don't think I ever had caramel like this before. It sticks in the teeth. Yeah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> wow. Cancel my plans. I'm eating the curly whirly. I need a good 25 minutes. But this is like, um, No, that's caramel. That is what. <laughs> Chocolate chip. Ooh! You can come here and you can just get one or two or three if you feel like just having a couple as a snack with whatever you happen to be drinking that Cup night. of tea. Cup of tea, because this is a children's show. <laughs> and these cookies are actually Canadian. So they carry products not only from the UK, but they carry products from Canada. Of course, they carry some products from the States and they carry products from Mexico. Fanta and the cola is imported from Mexico. Well, you know what? Let's try some. Um, 
taste testing? Yes. <laughs> so I'm going to turn around and you're going to fill these up. Yep. The Mexican Coca-Cola is made with cane sugar, whereas the Canadian is just regular, and there really is a difference. Jason! <laughs> Cheers! Okay, well I prefer the second one. The thing about a candy store is that it does something very specific. It satisfies your cravings. I understand when you need something sweet, you go to that go-to chocolate bar you've been having since you were a kid. But in Ryan's, they're doing something a little different. They're offering you a new craving experience. Something that's gonna satisfy you the exact same way, but with something a little different. So I'm saying take that chance. You go in there and you let them know what your craving is and chances are they'll find something even better than what you've been having for your whole life. Cause that's what happened to me. God save the queen. <laughs> Bottoms up. <laughs> Don't do that. Bottoms up. Bottoms up. All right, that's it. I'm done. Next, Putin.